What's up guys? I got a uh, little surprise for you. This is the uh, Horn Blasters Conductor 228 I believe. I don't know. With an added bonus. Got a, uh, oh, I want to go find John. I'm too tired for this. Now you can't. See. I got a toggle switch and a push button. And it doesn't fully charge up because, well, I'm gonna show you at the end of this video. As well, is why. We'll show you why. I'll tell you why. I'll go over the how I did the wiring oh, when I get inside. On my truck exhaust video, I get a lot of the uh, that stock. No, it's not. No. Nope. Pretty good. Now, the cool part. This is really the only reason that I got a train on. This is, I've helped so many people, it's... Oh, shit. How fucking awesome is that? Basically what I did was here let me climb up and show you. Oh damn, can't see it. Well I've got a copper T here. It's just a compression. Right off the tank, about a two, three inch plastic hose and then a copper T. This line comes out to the air horn, and the other goes to the, the fitting in the back. Okay, we have the battery. Push button, toggle, compressor. Run the power to the toggle. Jump to this, to the push button, and then I'll run this side out to the compressor. I got a ground back here. The uh, horn itself is grounded here. itself is jumped to the push button. I got a fusible link here and a fusible link here. 